The peace of Christ be with you, my friend. Well, today the Divine Roses would like to present a beautiful story about a farmer and his cornfield. Well, there was a farmer who grew excellent quality corn. Every year he won the prize for the best corn grown. One year a reporter interviewed him and learned something interesting about how he grew it. The reporter found out that the farmer shared the seeds of his corn with his neighbors. How can you afford to share your best corn seeds with your neighbors when they compete with your corn every year? asked the reporter. Why, sir? asked the farmer. Didn't you know that the wind picks up pollen from maturing corn and swirls it from field to field? If my neighbors grow inferior corn, cross-pollination will constantly degrade the quality of my corn. If I want to grow good corn, I need to help my neighbors grow good corn. Well, so it is with our lives. Those who want to live well and meaningfully must help and reach the lives of others because the value of a life is measured by the lives it touches. And he who chooses to be happy must help others find happiness because the well-being of each is tied to the well-being of all. Call it the power of the collective or call it the principle of success. Call it the law of life. The fact is, none of us really wins until we all win. We get to learn a good moral from the story of the farmer. The farmer just did what he wanted back. He grew and he allowed others to grow. So let us follow this beautiful golden rule which says do unto others as you would have them do unto you.